word on the street is that the Abbey just got a massive shipment of artisan sodas. I thought we could throw a couple back, like partners on the force in one of those buddy cop movies. Throw back. Ah, yes, like a toast? Agatha was quite fond of them. Bad idea. Know any good ones? Well, my Asgardian is quite rusty, but I suppose I could try. Of course, I would need some sort of goblet to throw into the mirror, and a nice sharp axe for the bl How about I go first just to set a nice safe benchmark? So, what flavor soda can I get you? There is more than one flavor? Oh, yeah. There's Thor's Thirst, Black Widow Bubbles, Loki Lime, Radioactive Rockenberry... Radioactive what? You know what? You just chill there, and I'll pick one out for you, partner. Hey. Can I ask a favor? Thanks, Hunter. You are going to love this. Welcome to Tony's Scary Demon Cave. I'm Tony, and how may I assist you today? You're welcome, Hunter. Allow us to assist you. All right, here's the plan. I'll hit this thing with the big hammer and you... See you, Hunter. I still say we should have built a firing range first. You're as good as they say. No pain, no gain. Jonah Jameson just said, Spider-Man's existence fosters an atmosphere of toxic paranormal activity in New York. Backbiters exist to sully the character of others. The Daily Bugle printed that I conjured the Hellmouth in New York City. First off, I didn't even know Hellmouths were real until last week. Second, New York already had a Hellmouth in Staten Island. I'm pretty sure vampires live there. Entertaining rumors and schoolyard taunts only empowers bullies. 
Sticks and stones may break my bones, yeah, yeah. What do sticks and stones have to do with our conversation? I forgot you don't know all our modern idioms. Even Captain America knows that one. Does the idiom have a conclusion? Words can never harm me. Falsehoods galore. A prophecy is literally words trying to exterminate us. When we finish Lilith, I will teach J. Jonah Jameson exactly how much words hurt. Maybe we don't. I need the income and he pays. Thanks for distracting me, Hunter. It's clear I gotta hire a publicist. Or better yet, just hit unsubscribe from the Daily Bugle on my newsfeed. Wow, I feel better already. Now, back to stopping the prophecy that will doom all mankind. I wish we could just unsubscribe from Lilith. If only it were that simple. Hunter. Hello? I'm learning a lot from you. Like how to avoid multiple sword jabs in rapid succession. I wouldn't have thought so, but it's good to hear those bells again after all this time. As hard as I tried to keep you out of the tower, you always found your way back in, just in time to wake her up at the crack of dawn. speak in private? Will this lead to the two of us shouting at one another? I cannot see how. Then yes. Nico needs help prepping for a magic surprise party. A surprise party? Have you met magic? Why do you say that? Oh, just a feeling. What does Nico want from me? Can you handle the cake? Of course. The trick will be hiding the icing. Magic Sweet Tooth can lead her to cupcakes at 50 paces. Good girl, Charlie. Who is a good girl? It is my Charlie girl. I'm happy to help, Hunter.
show no mercy. Is that it? I had a guess to warn body, but I think Lilith solved that too. I'm saving my energy so we need it. Alright, I'll play along. I am impressed. Let's do this one again. Sidekick. for the rest of us. Never surrender. I'm gonna get you for that. For a high drive! <laughs> Feels so good. Walk in the light. Welcome, assistance.
feel at least four percent stronger than before. You gotta check on that. Hydra is in control of the situation. Tracking multiple targets. Be fixated on me. Back in business. Should be good. I saw a move like that once, centuries ago. by your weakness. Might have pushed it too far. This should be good. We've done it. Excellent work. Next round's on me, Hunter. My nerves are still a little jittery. Are yours? No? Okay, just me then. That's cool. Why, 
hello, Hunter. You used to be a surgeon. Yes. What seems like long ago. Do you miss it? No. You are not usually so brief. Stephen Strange, the surgeon, was a very different person. Selfish, vain, and prone to grandiose delusions of grandeur. What could cause you so much shame? I cared more for personal status than my patients. Most of those were wealthier clients who could afford the procedures. I, I did no harm, mind you, but for all my talent, I can't say I did much good. I shall fondly await our next outing. Always here? Well, this looks like it belongs here. Almost as if it were meant to be here. A perfect fit. What do we have today?
Something smells pungent. That would be Grandma Stark's famous linguine and clam sauce, with some Tony adjustments. Grandma's recipe was not good enough? Well, I loved her to pieces, but she also loved vodka in her cooking, and I can't touch the stuff. Not anymore. I even made sure the Abbey has a dry bar. What did I do to deserve this honor? That's just my way of saying thank you for being one of the only Midnight Suns who hasn't threatened to banish me to the Netherworld, empty my jugular, or portal me to the sun. And that was just today. Perhaps if they knew more of the man underneath the armor, they would come to understand you as I have. Maybe you're right. The Mark series can be pretty imposing. I was not talking about your suit. Oh, that's deep. Just like the garlic-rich flavor of Grandma Stark's famous sauce. Ah, you two would have really hit it off. Like you, she had a heart of gold, but could be quite the demon when crossed. Used to frighten the crap out of Dad. I thought it gave her character. Know who else I'm pretty sure has character? Who? You. Bon appetit, Hunter. Can I ask a favor? Thanks, Hunter. Switching things up, eh, hey, boss? Someone is griefing me, Hunter. We must fight this head on. Thank you. Peter said to just let it go, but it happens every friggin' game. I team up with them, they don't shoot at anything, spam my chat, and eventually just kill me. Oh, I assumed you were talking about the Norwegian Gravitas curse. Why do you not change teammates? I tried, but they use different tags every time. Bok for life, centuries of slumber, mom slayer, dragoons are goons. All the same person, all are targeting me. Perhaps they are simply trying to be your friend. And since they are out of their element, with an age or a century difference, their well-meaning attempts only cause you harm. Perhaps they do not understand the controller schemes. Y you think? 
I know. I think you're right. Oh, now I feel bad. I said some not-so-nice things to them. I should be nicer to them next time. Less profanity would be appreciated. Think Dr. Strange knows Merlin? I'm still waiting for someone to take this sword. Ready to work? say about practice, right? Later. Ah, oh, this is exactly what I needed. A chance to quiet my cluttered mind and just... be. What thoughts clutter your mind, Doctor? Ever since the Sanctum was lost, I felt a bit adrift. Lost in a cosmic sea in which I've lost my ability to navigate. I've been giving a lot of thought to the direction my life will take if we survive your mother's apocalypse, but... Who am I if I'm not Sorcerer Supreme? Sorcerer Supreme or not, you are still an Avenger. But is that all I am? All I want to be? Perhaps this is what you should meditate on. Yes, that's a bright idea. Thank you for still having faith in me, even when I've lost faith in myself. You are proving to be a most unexpected friend. Everything by the numbers. Sending your friends out to fight isn't the easy... Stay out of trouble. Hey, hey, Hunter. Hunter? If Hydra wants a straight-up fight, then I say give them everything you've got. I will see at them. Show them what happens when you mess with the Midnight Suns. I got it.
look this kind of hot. Any of you dorks make a move yet? So You are nothing compared to the things I have seen and killed. away from limbo occasionally. What are the qualifications of the commander officer? I had a guess a warm body, but I think Lilith solved that too. to your union rep. I don't think you're supposed to be fighting on our level yet. Come on, let's do this. Done any way we know how. 
I doubt they'll take that beating to heart, but we can always hope. Ready for shop class? I am ready. Right on. Wait, what's Tony doing here? It's interesting how you solved the heat problem. Is that a good interesting or a bad interesting? Neither. It's just not what I would have done. Right. <laughs> Okay, before you ask, Tony kind of showed up and started talking. The more the merrier. Yeah. I mean, he's Tony Stark. How do you say no to that guy? I don't know how to talk to rich people. Would you mind? All right. Thanks, Hunter. What did Parker say? Tony just showed up. Oh, this is getting weirder and weirder. Good weird or bad weird? I mean, he's Tony Stark. Confirmed super genius? Why would he want to slum it with us? Let me talk to Tony. <sighs> I'll follow your lead. Hey boss. Fancy meeting you here. I didn't picture you for the technical type. Wait, no, I'm seeing it. You're someone who's always appreciated horsepower. What brings you here, Tony? I couldn't sleep. Saw Parker slip off with a backpack full of gadgets. I was tired and bored, so I followed him here. You know, the only time I've seen the Hell Ride is when it's on fire. You think uh, Robbie will let me poke around under the hood? Shop class is open to you. Well, that's nice, boss, but I don't plan to stay if I'm not welcome. Look, this isn't my thing, and I don't want to make it my thing. I'll stick around as long as Robbie and Parker are cool with it. All right. We should ask them. The two of you heard me, right? Uh, yeah. Sure did. So, what do you think? I'll be completely invisible. Like Sue Storm? Like a slightly taller Sue Storm. Yeah, we're happy to have you. I mean, as long as the shop doesn't become a Stark subsidiary, I'm good. Scout's honor. Then welcome to shop class, Tony. All right. You kids do your thing. We have no big threats on the horizon, so today we're going to retool some of our gear. No big threats? What about Lilith? Shop class deals with known quantities. Lilith alters fundamental scientific principles just by existing. She's way out of our league. Besides, we have a ton of ideas in the backlog for these personal prototypes. It all depends on the components at hand. You already gave me the components. Those will come in handy. So, are we good to go on this project? I am ready. When you're ready to take off. I am ready to go. So, Tony, um, did you have any thoughts on the project? What, who, me? I'm, I'm contributing now? We, uh, just wanted to know what you think. 
The Hunter has more options against the Fallen. I think shop class has already proved its worth. Really? <laughs> no comment. But that's some good work. <laughs> <laughs>